Good morning, everyone. I have some exciting and very quick, <laughs> unexpected news. I'm moving actually today. It's 10 o'clock right now and I'm getting the keys to my new place at one o'clock. I haven't even started packing yet, but I'm just moving to a different apartment in the same complex. So it's gonna be a really simple, easy move. I'm moving into a one bedroom apartment. I'm ready for a little bit more space. Surely everyone is tired of seeing my apartment all over the internet at this point. <laughs> I feel like after my apartment therapy feature and my apartment tour, it's got to be starting to get a little boring. I hope you guys will be interested in seeing how I decorate the new place. I'm really excited to make more videos and I feel more inspired and I feel like it's going to be new energy and fresh energy. I was just kind of feeling like really non-creative anymore here and just like, you know, it's just like, you know when you feel like it's time for a change. It was time. This apartment was really a home for me and Sally. Ever since Sally passed away, I've been like decently open about how I've processed grieving her and how hard it's been. This apartment just reminds me of her constantly. I think in that aspect it's going to be nice to close this chapter. As soon as I get the keys I will show you guys the new tour. You can see I haven't even started packing one single thing. I just got the keys to my new place. It's really similar to my old one. Just kind of like opposite um, floor plan, but this this space right here is like my favorite part. And there's a little area right here. The bathroom is pretty much the same, but this is this is it right here. This is the bedroom. <laughs> what I've been living without for four years so it's pretty big and then there's a walk-in closet which is so oh there's shelving all the way at the top wow which is just like so crazy to me that I'm gonna have a walk-in closet but yeah this is it I'm definitely gonna change that fixture out my landlord loved the last fixture that I changed out and he asked me to leave it so if you're a renter, sometimes changing things out aren't always a bad thing. Um, yeah, I'm excited. I'm gonna start moving stuff in. And this is the current moving situation. <laughs> oh my gosh. It's not fun. Okay, it's the end of day one. It was a little bit more delayed because because my landlord was here patching holes and doing some more work to my new place. It's really hot today. It's like 80 degrees and um, I'm going to call it a night. This is what my place is looking like now. The lighting is not great, but um, it's pretty empty, I guess, in here. Mark is coming over and we're going to get Thai food and sleep in this apartment tonight, my studio. He's gonna help me move my bed and my sofa and like some of the bigger pieces tomorrow. I'll finish everything up and update you all on how it looks. I'm tired. I'm like emotionally, I'm like mentally tired and that's making me very physically tired. It's just moving is, it just kind of takes a toll. And I was like really debating on if I was confident in my decision to even get a new place. So that's been kind of stressful, just like not knowing for sure if I made the right decision. And then also just the stress of like switching everything over, like internet and mail and you know, I mean, for a, mo for a move, this is low stress because I'm literally just moving like a few apartments away. So I'm not having to like pack everything and bubble wrap and like boxes, but it's just a lot of like back and forth. Yeah, I, whatever, moving's exhausting. We all know that, I don't need to explain it. Anyway, so I'm gonna just chill out for the rest of the night, wait for Mark to get here, eat some bomb Thai food and get started tomorrow. And I'll update you guys then. Okay, that's it. Just finished completely moving out of my old apartment. Let me do a little empty apartment tour. Totally different, totally empty. I'm really happy actually, I'm feeling really good about it. Good morning, it's now another day. This moving process has taken like three days total, which it's been like chill because it's not moving far, but 
It's just been kind of like drawn out. I'm just gonna give you a little tour of what it looks like with all my stuff in here. And maybe you guys will get excited, as excited as I am about how it's gonna look once I really dig my claws into it and get some design going. So here we have the bedroom and this is pretty much all I've got going on so far. But yeah, you can see how it's kind of put together, but not really. And the AC's on in here, so there's gonna be some background noise, sorry about that. This is where my little office is gonna be. And I have the bathroom pretty much unpacked. Here, I'll show you. I have the bathroom unpacked, but um, I just wanna like make it a little bit cuter. Like I have my stuff organized, but I took the ugly um, towel rack down, so I wanna just like, you know, make it better this is the disaster zone of the living room and the kitchen so yeah i have my work cut out for me i just spilled ice all over the floor i really i don't know believe it or not let me walk i'm gonna walk back in here because the ac is kind of loud believe it or not i have like all the kitchen drawers unpacked all the food unpacked and everything so everything that's on the countertop is like just my plants and dishes stuff i need to part ways with but i'm just like not totally ready that is my move. What a shock, right? What a surprise. I'm surprised. I think I'm going to end this video here. Stay tuned for more decorating videos. I think I'm going to start with the bedroom because it's been so long since I had a bedroom. <laughs> sleeping in there was like bizarre. Like actually sleeping in an enclosed room, it was like really cool. I felt like the feng shui vibes were really there. The first thing I want to tackle is my bedroom. I'm excited for the living room, but I also feel kind of like um, I don't know what to do with it yet. So once I can get some inspiration, and I think the inspiration will come to me once I get a little bit more unpacked, then I, I'll be more excited for that. Anyway, that's it for this video. Let me know what you guys think. Hopefully you're not too sad that I left the studio because that's kind of like how I started my YouTube channel is through my studio apartment tour. So I kind of feel like that's my brand, but I'm moving on. Thanks for being here. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye.